Um, so Jahavid Bashrat is taking on Mateus Men- Mendoka. How do you do that in that in, in Brazil, that C with the little underscore thing? But I'm going to call him Matus for now. Javid Bajrat and, and Matus are – oh, there's Matus Rebecca on this card. Shit, I can't call Matus. Mendonca. So we got Bajrat, Mendonca. Bajrat minus 315. Mendonca plus 260. And this is a, a parlay piece I'm actually into. Well, line open uh, to Bajrat minus 260. So it has steamed a little bit. But yeah, so- and I, I I agree with the steam. He's a guy who we saw. I mean, we're we pay very close attention to Tony Gravely fights, yeah. and Bashra picked him apart. I know that Tony won the first round on the scorecards, but that was a a little bit of a, a toss up for me. Um, Bashra is extremely dangerous everywhere, especially on the feet with his footwork, his accuracy. Um, he fights at a steady but super fast pace. Um, he can he can wrestle and, and took down Tony, who's an all American, who's an American top team, absolute beast when it comes to uh, his wrestling chops. Um, so I do like this Basharat spot um, as a parlay piece. I think this is a guy the UFC's building. He's undefeated. I don't think that a guy like Mendonca um, is on the same level as a Gravely. Are you concerned, though, about Madonka's ability to finish via submission, via KO? I mean, he's young, he's powerful, he's got a big frame for 35. Are you worried that you're going to be holding a ticket on a guy who can get that flash KO? Or do you think Bashrat's got, from what you've seen, the fight IQ to kind of keep that at bay? I think Bashrat's got it covered. Uh, I I think that everyone's real dangerous when you get down to it, and I I don't think that a guy like Mendonca is even as dangerous as a Trevin Jones in terms of one punch power. Okay. I like that. So 